Today, we're going to be discussing how Handheld Legend uses our 3D printers in our everyday business. Let's get right into it. Let's start off with the basics. What exactly is a 3D printer? Well, a 3D printer is a machine that takes a model that you've created in a design or CAD software and it recreates it in real life out of plastic or other materials, but in our case, plastic. FDM machines take rolls of plastic called filament that's 1.75 millimeters in diameter, in some cases three, and it creates your model layer by layer in plastic. So now we know how a 3D printer works, but how does Handheld Legend use it in our daily experiences? Well, the first example is prototyping products. For example, we're creating console maintenance stands. They allow the buttons of a console to fully sit down into the shell without pushing up on the motherboard while you're building it. This makes working on consoles slightly more comfortable and a little bit easier too. We started off in CAD, where I designed the console maintenance stand. From there, all we had to do was send the STL file over to our 3D printer and from there, within a couple hours, we had our prototype. While it was a little bit undersized, we're able just to print another one that's scaled up until it works. This allows for rapid prototyping, even with failures. So now that we know we can prototype products with a 3D printer, what else can we do? Well, we can even make finished products using them. For example, we have spacer kits for our GBC TFT kits. These are entirely 3D printed, and they hold the screens perfectly in place so that they don't move around. Another example of this is GBA-SP. The USB-C modules will always have open room when you remove the original port. That means that we're going to use 3D printed spacers to fill up that room and help keep the port secure in its location. Simply slide in your 3D printed part as you're assembling your console, and you're done. We also have Game Gear Clean Screen Lens Brackets. They keep the screen perfectly in the center of the lens every time. While it is technically with a different 3D printing technology, our GC pocket adapter shells are also 3D printed. We're also experimenting with using 3D printed parts for injection molding and potentially getting our cases actually molded. Hopefully that gives you a better understanding of how we use our 3D printers here at Handheld Legend. If you have any questions or you just want to chat, feel free to join our Discord located in the description.